This is the ground level city noise in a busy location, around 80 dB. We'll go up until we reach whisper level noise. Wow. If you go just three floors up, street chatter is already lower. But watch out, it can vary a lot up here. You can be more exposed to the streets than the ground level because of orientation, trees, and other things. On the 15th floor, city noise is no longer projected directly. Sounds are perceived in the background. A siren would still be heard loudly, even this high up. Besides the occasional speeding sound disturbing everyone's peace, city traffic is usually slow speed. Traffic at 30 miles per hour sounds half as loud as traffic at 65 miles per hour. But also, 2,000 vehicles per hour sound twice as loud as 200 vehicles per hour. That averages to about the same. If you go up to the 25th floor, the urban noise is even more faded, smoother, less variable, and lower amplitude. A good thing to remember is that if you keep the windows closed, city noise is reduced by about 12 decibels on any level. On the 50th floor, you get about 54 dB city noise in the day. This is the scientist's accepted point of comfort. With the windows closed, you can get this noise level way lower on the 15th floor. Still haven't found whisper level noise though. Keep watching. Here's the 70th floor. You are now at a crazy quiet 45 dB. Side note, if you live so high up, an elevator trip could take you more than 60 seconds, but the views are amazing. Don't forget about airplanes though. When you live on a high floor, airplanes and helicopters passing can be much louder. Now let's skip ahead to the 100th floor. Here we have a 39 dB city noise level, barely noticeable. For reference, the humming of a fridge is the same noise level. If you close the windows, the noise level is similar to that of a whisper. Yes, that's the most luxurious spot. Whisper level city noise is on the 100th floor with the windows closed. So what's the point of this whole video? Just close the freaking windows.